नाउ द नेक्स्ट टॉपिक इज डिफरेंस बिटवीन हीट एंड टेम्परेचर राइट सो विल ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड द डिफरेंस बिटवीन दीज टू विच वी हैव ऑलरेडी एक्सप्लेन आई एम जस्ट कैटेगरिकली गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन यू वॉट इज द डिफरेंस बिटवीन हीट एंड टेम्परेचर राइट सो दीज आर माई अर्लियर नोट्स यू कैन सी इन डिस्क्रिप्शन द प्रीवियस वीडियो वेयर आई हैव एक्सप्लेन दिस राइट सो द वेरी फर्स्ट डिफरेंस इज हीट इज ए फॉर्म ऑफ इंटरनल इनर्जी राइट आई हैव एक्सप्लेन दैट हीट इज ए फॉर्म ऑफ इंटरनल इनर्जी ऑप्टेन ड्यू टू रैंडम मोशन राइट लेट से दिस इज अ बॉडी और एनी सब्सटेंस और लेट से आयरन बार एंड दैट बार कंटेन सो मेनी मॉलिक्यूल्स राइट एंड दीज मॉलिक्यूल्स आर हैविंग सम काइंड ऑफ ए मोशन फर्स्ट मोशन इज रैंडम मोशन एंड फॉर दैट इट रिक्वायर इट विल बी हैविंग अ कैनेटिक इनर्जी एंड अनदर मोशन इज अट्रैक्टिव फोर्स मॉलिकुलर अट्रैक्टिव फोर्स मोशन राइट एंड दैट इज बीन जनरेटेड और बिकॉज ऑफ दैट अ काइंड ऑफ पोटेंशियल इनर्जी इज बीन जनरेटेड राइट एंड इफ यू कंबाइन दोज टू कैनेटिक एंड पोटेंशियल एनर्जी इट विल बिकम इंटरनल इनर्जी राइट सो दिस इज आई हैव एक्सप्लेन वेरी मच इन डिटेल इन माई अर्लियर वीडियो सो द वेरी फर्स्ट डिफरेंस इज हीट इज ए फॉर्म ऑफ इंटरनल इनर्जी ऑप्टेन ड्यू टू रैंडम मोशन एंड अट्रैक्टिव फोर्स ऑफ मॉलिक्यूल इन एनी सब्सटेंस राइट नाउ इन केस ऑफ ए टेम्परेचर टेम्परेचर इज ए क्वांटिटी विच डिटरमाइंस द डायरेक्शन ऑफ फ्लो राइट so i have explained the concept of temperature where i have mentioned it determines the direction of flow that is from hot body to cold body right so temperature is a, a quantity which determines the direction of flow of heat on keeping two bodies at different temperature at contact so if i have two bodies one is hot one is cold and if i put both bodies in contact then this blue line de uh, determines that now this hot body starts cooling and this cold body starts warming right so this is what i have explained in my previous video so now this is i am going to explain or this is i am going to write as a very first difference between heat and temperature so for heat i am just writing in green color so first difference is heat is a form of internal energy how this internal energy obtained internal energy obtained i have just now explain due to random motion first is random motion right random motion and the second one is attractive force okay so another one is attractive force between whom Be between because of molecules okay molecules where in a any body or substance s u b s t a n c e whereas in temperature let me write in this color uh temperature 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 is a quantity temperature is a quantity which determines what direction of flow right which determines the direction of flow d i r e c t i o n direction of flow flow of what flow of heat right when on keeping the two bodies at different temperature right if there 
is a difference only then direction is there if two bodies are on same temperature then there will be no flow of energy right so that's why this is also very important different temperature right but direction only happen when both two bodies are in contact okay so temperature in contact right so this is the very first difference between heat and temperature right now the second one is i have explained already in my previous video see whatever i have explained i am just writing here because in in the book if you can see is mentioned explicitly the difference between heat and temperature let me just show you quickly see this is the point i am explaining right what is uh, mentioned in 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 icsc book difference between heat and temperature right so i am explaining all this point and as you know, already know that whatever mentioned in this book i am explaining word by word so that once you guys start reading the book there will be no difficulty right now the second point is the si unit of heat is joule now this is where i have explained let me just quickly check c si unit of heat is joule right so this is already i have explained and in case of temperature we have already read that in si unit of temperature is kelvin right this is the second point let me just quickly write this as well so second point is si unit of heat is joule j o u l e and is been denoted by capital j and in case of temperature si unit si unit of temperature is kelvin okay and this is been denoted by capital k now third point is the amount of heat contained in a body depends on three things right remember i have explained this uh, by, by the help of three experiments right so here you can see i have mentioned that there are three factors one is the mass second one is the temperature and third one is the material or substance of the body right so amount of heat contained in a body depends upon the mass temperature and the substance of the body whereas the temperature of the body if i'm talking about the temperature part temperature of a body depends on the average kinetic energy of its molecule due to its random motion so whatever be the average kinetic energy of the molecules right so for example in this body there are so many molecules right and the molecules having as a kinetic energy kinetic energy because of what because of this random motion of these molecules right so the temperature of the body depends on the average of this kinetic energy of its molecule due to its random motion right so this is what i have already explained in my very first video and i'm again saying if you have any doubt you can just check the description where you can find the library of uh, complete calorie metry and you can find it there right so the third point is the amount of heat contained contained in a body depends depends on what first is mass of the body right mass of the body this i have already explained with the help of three experiments right second one is the temperature second one is the temperature and third one is the substance okay substance of the body 
substance of the body right and in case of temperature this been depends upon the average kinetic energy so the temperature of a body depends on depends on the average 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 of what average kinetic energy of that substance molecule okay of its molecule and why this kinetic energy is being generated because due to due to their random motion right due to their random motion okay so this is about third difference fourth one is very straightforward that heat is measured measured by the principle of calorimetry friend this i have not explained you guys yet so i will explain in upcoming videos probably in next video okay so do watch my uh, the remaining part of the video uh, so heat is measured by the principle of calorimetry whereas in case of temperature we already know how do we uh, measure the uh, the fever in our home that is with the help of thermometer so and that's how we are saying now the temperature of the body is what so temperature is measured measured by a thermometer thermometer okay now another principle which is very easy to understand i have already explained to you guys as well that two bodies having the same quantity of heat may differ in their in their temperature why let me just write it and i will explain you that as well so two bodies having same quantity same quantity of heat may differ may differ in their temperature okay temperature will be different why because the heat is being generated because of two energy one is kinetic and and potential energy of the molecules so every substance or every body is having a different kind of uh, uh, this kinetic and potential energy of those molecules so that's why the heat the two bodies having a same quantity of heat may different in their temperature and in case of temperature we can say that two bodies at the same temperature if two bodies having same temperature may differ in their quantity of heat containing them right and the logic will be the same one because these two bodies are having different kind of kinetic and potential energy or internal energy if we can say right so for the same logic we can say two bodies two bodies at same temperature same temperature may differ may differ in the quantities quantities of heat contained in them okay contained in them right so this is the fifth difference and the last difference when two bodies are placed in contact the total amount of heat is equal to the sum of individual body right so let's try to understand this when two bodies are placed in contact let's say we have this body right and this body this body is having a heat h1 and this body is having heat h2 
now the total amount of heat if you ask the total heat total heat this will be the sum of these two individual heat heated body so this will be h1 plus h2 right so let me just write this when two bodies when two bodies are placed in contact okay just imagine this they, they are in contact right they are in contact they are touched each other then the total amount then the total amount of heat is equal to the sum of sum of heat of individual body individual body so here in this case individual body is h1 and h2 right so this is about heat now what about temperature now here let me write let's say we have a two bodies at different temperature again we have two bodies one is having uh, sorry one is having temperature t1 and another one is having a temperature t2 are in place in contact okay so we have contacted we have make sure that these two bodies i said this is b1 this is b2 we have touched these two bodies then the resultant temperature then the resultant temperature let's say t dash is a temperature in between the two temperature right so what will be the uh, temperature of t1 and t2 this will be the between the two temperature right so let's say if this is a 10 degree this is 20 degree then the between temperature will be somewhere around let's say 15 degree right so let me just write it when two bodies at different temperature are placed in contact in contact the resultant temperature the the resultant temperature is a temperature in between the two temperature right so let's say one body is having a temperature of uh, 10 degree celsius and another one is 20 degree celsius then this will be become 15 degree celsius right i'm just giving a, a example to explain you this point right so friend this is all about the difference between heat and temperature